All right, well, it's been a while since I've made a video. I've been out of the game for a while. <clears throat> I uh, just started watching YouTube videos again, and I came up on this guy. It's the uh, Firefly... Uh, woo, no, Fly Woo Firefly uh, FR-16, and it looked awesome. And then um, they told me it comes in different video capabilities, and then they started bringing up Walk Snail and... HC zero and then I started doing all this research on HC zero and it just it looked way too good to be true and my friend Les actually has the module that hooks up to the fat sharks and I was thinking about getting them and then I went to plug my fat sharks in to fly my whoop around the house and they didn't work so I was like this sucks but it's a great time do this. So I actually purchased this. I don't I don't know much about them. Um <clears throat> they just came today. It took like six weeks to come. So I'm just gonna do a real quick unboxing. This isn't like an, a technical unboxing. I'm not that smart. I just wanna, you know, let everybody see the the first you know, first-hand uh, observation of me first-hand opening it. <laughs> I'm super excited, though. You know, I've, I'm a I'm a <clears throat> an analog guy. I've been flying for a while, and uh, it's uh, this. I never thought this would come. I w I've always been anti anti fat shark because I just think that they're not in it for us and. Um, especially with this remote ID bullshit coming up. I know they're going to build that right into all their quads. So why even waste time uh, thinking about buying those? I have friends that like that. Oh my God, it's beautiful. I have friends that like those um, and fly them. And they say it's great and I believe it. But for, with my experience, the, laten the latency is ridiculous. I know the the quality of video on these isn't going to be as spectacular as... HD, uh, HD, um, as spectacular, spect spectacular as the Walks Now or the DJI, but the latency is going to be so much better, and I fly crazy proximity and shit like that, so I might as well worry about the latency over that, but these are beautiful, they're, they're they feel really good, um, and compared to the analog I fly, the picture on this is just going to be night and day, you know? Ooh, look at these bad boys. I can't see anything. Just kidding. All right, so yeah, uh, here is the goggles. Apparently, there's two face plates in here. These things feel, they're definitely heavier <clears throat> than my Fat Sharks. I, I never went into the HDOs because, like, I'd say five months before the HDOs came out, I got the HD3s. And that's what everybody was flying at the time. And I love them. And the HDOs have like a smaller screen. So I, well, <clears throat> I wasn't going to sacrifice screen size for a tiny bit better resolution. So that just wasn't going to happen. All right, there's an accessory box here. Oh, i got to get this bad boy out. I'm sorry it's taking so long. Um, yeah, so. But I was smart. And I bought this in HD Zero, and it came like two weeks ago, and I'm like dying to fly it. And I bought um, all the antennas, and I bought the the, ana the analog module. Um, so I'm set on these things. I I keep hearing people talking about binding. I don't know if you got to bind these guys. I hope not, because you know I I don't want to spend time doing crazy dumb shit when I just want to fly. All right, um, I was told that this came with two face plates. Oh, one's on there. They're the, all right, they're a little different. They look like Robin. <laughs> I'm just fucking around. <laughs> all right, I guess the, the one that's on there. So, uh, these are, <clears throat> I have a pretty round face. And I guess these are good for those. Um, this actually doesn't seem that, I, I expected it to be flatter than this all right so you get two of these face plates you get the um 
goggles themselves, you get this nice strap for the back. It feels pretty nice. I don't know why I did that. Uh, and this is a barrel connector for um, battery. So I'm going to say everybody says four to uh, two to six S. I would prefer to just use the same 2S battery that I had on um, my Fat Sharks and see if that will last or if it's just going to um, die and I'm not going to be able to use them for very long. So we'll see. This is nice. I've heard that this is nice. Oh, it's, is that velvet? <laughs> Bet you guys don't know where that's from. All right. All right. So let's see what we got here. This looks like m3 padding oh you get two so you can put it you can put the velcro on both of these um john's john's there is that philly word john um let's see this this foam the foam's a little thin way thinner than i thought the foam that i have on my uh fat sharks is i'd say feels a little better than this maybe i'll have to figure something out for that i don't know it's not bad but it's um yeah so there you go simple unboxing it's already at almost seven minutes so i'm really excited about this i'm really excited to maybe start putting out more videos um i miss flying i miss the community i miss my friends you know i work an ungodly amount of hours um in the kitchen every week so um i'm gonna try to do at least one video a month or something like that. I'm gonna keep flying. I'm gonna rebuild, you know, I'm gonna go all the way from this all the way up to the five inches I used to fly. You know, I'm, everybody flies 6S now. I've never done that. I'm still in 4S. That's how long it's been since I've flown. It's, you know, the 6S just started coming out when I was flying. So, but I am super excited for these HD Zero goggles. And uh, yeah. I'm gonna put them together and I'm gonna I'm gonna walk around the house like this. I don't care if I bang in the shit or not. Cause these things are fucking dope. And I can't wait to see the quality of the video inside. Alright guys. Peace.